What's up, everybody? It's me, Dylan. We're watching Tobacco Tuesday. As you can see, I'm back here at Cigar Warehouse. So I want to give a big thank you to them. And also a big thank you for introducing me to these suckers. These are part of the Esteban uh, Cigar Company. They're fairly new to the, the franchise. And so far, they're coming up with some unique stuff. For starters, they are creating a new process where they kind of where they crush out or make the cigar sweat out that really peppery bite. So they have a very sweet taste. Now these are very very uh, dark cigars, as you can well see. So they're more full flavored than my normal milds that I've always reviewed for you guys. So this is a first one for this channel. And I hope you all enjoyed this video. So let's see. That's that's really sweet, actually, for such a dark cigar, which you know usually indicate that it's a full flavor. Ah, ah, it doesn't have like that really bitey taste to it that a lot of those other ones usually have. Yeah, you know, I normally am more into mild cigars just because they're a little bit softer, but this. If I were to smoke this in a dark room, I wouldn't know the difference. Hmm. Alright, this is good. It's got... Now... If you can see right down there, it says OPA, which stands for Olivia Perez and... Something I can't pronounce the names all of that well, I'll be honest. But no, there are three families that started growing their tobacco in Cuba. However, they had to move thanks to that ban and they set up shop in Nicaragua, which that's where this is from. So, in my book, it's pretty much in Cuba because it uses the exact same seeds that they use, they use the exact Everything is the same, only difference is it is grown in Nicaragua. So it's a Nicaragua Cuba hybrid, I'll say. You know, I got the other taste is kind of floral. I'll be honest. You know, and it's not disgusting in floral like I've had with some cigars in my past, where it just feels like I ate a flower. No, this is actually pretty good. This is bite, which is why I like. There's none of that peppery biteness, which is, you know, what's well that's good. But other times, you want something simple, and that's what this does. This is a good cigar. I'm gonna give this very nine out of ten, mainly because I gotta get to see what else they offer. And for all I know, oh, halfway through the cigar it might change flavors on me. I don't know yet. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Sorry that I can't give you much information on this because this is, like I said, a new cigar offered. I was able to get them from Cigar Warehouse. You can too. If you live in Tucson, stop on by. I'm usually here every most Saturdays. But overall, you know, go out, try something new. That's what I did, and I don't regret it ever. Alright, y'all take care now.